Hello guys what's up? It's me DJ Vision X with a new tutorial video. In this video we are going to learn how to make a studio acapella in just 2 minutes. Yes you heard right in just 2 minutes. We will be using Isotope RX7 for this purpose. So let's get started. First let's have a look on the initial and the final output. Now let's have a look on the acapella created using Isotope RX7. So let's head towards creating a cappella. For that I want you to open Isotope RX7. You should come up with the interface like this. Now drag and drop the song you want to make a cappella of. In my case it's out of Haslam song. Now wait for it to process. After that, click on Music Rebalance tab on the right hand side of the Isotope RX7. Now, you should come up with the interface like this. Now, select the option of Isolate Vocal Aggressive and bring Sensitivity to 6. You can also play around with the other sensitivity to get more clear result. But I am gonna leave it the same. And, press Render to create a cappella. This might take some time depending upon your PC performance. So have some patience. I am gonna skip the rendering process. This is how it looks after rendering the acapella. Have a look on it. Now let's move forward and export the acapella. I am gonna save the acapella to the desktop. This is gonna take some time. So have some patience and wait for some time. You can also use the options on the right hand side for more clear acapella. But I am not going to explain it today. It is just a short tutorial video on making an acapella. So we will go only through the basics in this tutorial. Now you can drag and drop the acapella to the FL Studio and have some equalizer on it. You can cut some low frequencies and boost some of the mid-range frequencies to make acapella more clear. You can also add a reverb and delay to the acapella. This will make the acapella more like studio acapella. So we have successfully created a clear acapella using Isotope RX7. I hope this video will be useful to you. If you have any problem related to it then you can ask it in the comment section. And, if you enjoyed the video then don't forget to hit like on video and subscribe to us. Till then have a nice day.